three, two, one, zero. Okay, we have it. We have launch abort. A roller coaster rocket ride. Two problems eventually caused the last second scrub of tonight's launch. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Anken. Thanks for joining us tonight. SpaceX made the decision, or at least their computers did, to stop the countdown at the Cape with just one second to go, just as these engines here were coming to life. News 6's Troy Campbell was there for the dramatic launch abort, and Troy, we're learning that one problem led to the other tonight. Yeah, that's right, Eric. So first what happened is a boat popped into the area that's prohibited. Now, once they were able to actually get that boat out of the way, it was too late. The fuel on board the rocket, it became too warm. Three, two, one, zero. Okay, we have it. We have launch abort. Proceed. Take off, abort it, just one second before liftoff. In fact, the Falcon 9 was so close to leaving the launch pad that, look, the engines were already firing when the abort command was given. The precious cargo on board, a satellite, expected to bring internet to about 22 million households in Asia, is safe tonight. Elon Musk tweeting, launch aborted on low thrust alarm, rising oxygen temps due to hold for boat and helium bubble triggered alarm. Musk is referring to a boat that wandered into the prohibited area around the launch pad, causing a delay just long enough for the extra cold liquid oxygen fuel chilled to a minus 340 degrees to warm up. Say blast off. <laughs> blast off. <laughs> for tourists and locals alike, many were hoping Sunday's third attempt since Wednesday would be a success. Uh, we just really wanted to see it blast off, you know, see the, we were watching it on the, um, video there and could see the close-up of the rocket but just wanted to see it from far away and like I said exciting for the kids so so disappointing I really wanted to see it for safety yeah. I sure like to know about the ship that supposedly screwed this up Yes, a lot of people disappointed coming down to the moment there here this evening. Now, SpaceX also says that a fourth attempt of a launch will not take place for at least 48 hours. And, of course, we'll continue to keep you updated once a launch date is set. Live in Brevard County tonight, Troy Campbell, News 6.